Hello everyone and welcome back. As you'll recall, uh, if you follow my my channel, I uh, bought a Bose Wave radio uh, maybe a little over a month ago and uh, was not packaged properly. It got damaged in transit. Um, so I uh, went ahead now and uh, purchased another uh, Bose Wave radio. This is a Bose Wave System 3 uh, on uh, on eBay. And uh, I'm trying to figure out how to get into this one. I think we're going to go through the sides here. And so anyway, um, the, I ended up repairing the the old, the, the one that I received a while ago, the Bose Wave radio, but uh, I knocked out the LCD. Uh, so I decided I needed a Bose Wave radio that has an LCD working and also a uh, uh, I got the CD player working in the old one, and it's still working, of course, but uh, no LCD, so I decided to buy another one. So I was told by the person on eBay that he would package this. He packages all his packages very well, and so, and so he said it would be no different from my package. So I'm uh, pretty happy so far uh, with some with the packaging that I see. It's been uh, looks like it's looks like it's made it in one piece. And uh, uh, here we are, okay, see that. we have the cord, and uh, this is, let me see, this is the, that seems like the original cord, yeah, that's the original, uh, it's for PS2, well maybe it's not, maybe it's not the proper cord, because the antennas, this, an, this cord is actually the antenna, so I'm not exactly sure if a non Bose Wave cable will work properly. Uh, I checked the listing and it said the cord, but it... And we soon find out. We have a, some literature here. I'll cab off camera. Okay, that's good. And we're getting down to the nitty gritty here. I, I know the remote is in there somewhere. The, uh, the actual compartment that holds the battery was missing. That was in the listing, as you can see. Uh, Bose Wave System 3, so it's the proper remote, and it looks to be in good shape as the photos uh, indicate it. And uh, it's uh, 2012. I don't know if you can see in there, but you can check the date of the remotes anyway. If it comes at the radio, uh, September 2012, I believe. So the radio is a 2012, probably sold in 2013. Let me continue on. We have another cord here. Uh, this is probably the uh, the proper one, I'm not sure. I will check because I got one that is the proper one. Like I say, this is the antenna as well as the power cord. So I'm not exactly sure how I ended up with two cords, but there you go. There was only supposed to be one, of course. Uh, I'm, I'm liking the packaging so far. Uh, the protection that's been ported to this radio. And uh, so we'll take this out. And I don't think there's anything else in here. I don't think. So we'll uh, unravel this radio. Here we are. Okay, I'm just gonna cut my way in here. Hoping that there's no damage. I don't think there is. Uh, like I say, it's been it's pretty well packaged. So. I'm happy so far, and we're in. Get this out of the way, grab this gently, and put it on the desk. Yeah, it's in good shape, I must say. Uh, so far, let's have a look at the front. Front is good, and the bottom, and the sides. Okay, I'm happy with that. This is the, uh, get that in a shot if I can. If you can see that. Bose Wave, Bose Wave Music System 3. Okay. All right, so we're going to plug in the radio. And I think he might be missing a PS2 cord because there's two cords here. For some reason he sent two cords. 
might have been a mistake maybe in packaging because it, it, it is a busy eBay channel so we certainly want to see this thing power up and then we're going to try the CD player and if it's all functioning well you can be certain that he will be getting a good review an awesome review actually if I'm happy I certainly pass on my uh, well wishes and uh, that to the seller typically that's usually what happens most of the time okay we are ready for power up so let's plug it in okay the clock is on please wait okay now I have to go get my other remote because this one here doesn't have the battery nor the battery compartment so stand by okay we're back and this is a wave music system uh, remote that came with the old the other um, Bose wave radio that got damaged in shipping and so we're gonna see if we can get this powered up with this there we are and we'll hit the power button no disc I don't know if the volume's up or down so I'll turn all the volumes up pretty loud let's try the AM I don't want to get a copyright strike here so I'm gonna to go to AM FM okay it's working um, tuning seek lovely okay the main thing is now from here on out my concern is the only other concern I would have would be a non working CD player, which are sometimes common. So we'll go back to the infamous Bob Seeger, I should say famous, not infamous, and we'll see what happens when we put the CD into the player. I'll uh, tip this up so you can see the screen, see what's happening. It should take the CD pretty well right away, and it will. And uh, reading and we got beautiful okay the seller is going to get a top rated review for sure in their feedback I want to thank that person uh, for being honest and sincere good awesome communications the radio uh, is as is it'll clean up quite, quite nicely I think this is a touch on and touch on. Yeah, it is. It's actually touch on. You can touch it on. If I, if I show you this, just want to let you know that. There we go. And uh, I guess we have to put it on the radio to make it work properly. Yeah. Let's get a FM here. And uh, off. On. Ooh. There you go. Okay, I'm not going to go much any further with this video. I want to thank everybody for watching and for following along. This radio is not going to be uh, worked on because it's working fine. It's a, the last radio I had was a 2006, and the CD player wasn't working, and the cabinet got damaged in shipping. And, of course, you, you if you want to go back and watch the video, I damaged the LCD, I believe. I think I damaged it uh, when I was uh, reassembling the radio while it was still uh, plugged in and putting the ribbon cable up into the LCD. That's possibly my mistake. I think I'm probably on the hook for that one. This is a 2012, probably has low mileage on it, so I may not have to go in and do the CD player work or any other work that would need to be done, so I'll be able to enjoy this radio for some time to come. Thank you all for watching.